Have you ever wondered why the guy with the guitar in the bar always manages to get the girls while you have to go home alone every night? Have you ever tried to pick up a guitar but it sounded so bad that you quit instantly and have never picked it up again? Well, worry not. I, Ruben Singh Dongol, with a, a guitar playing experience of six plus years is ready to help you. Uh, I'm only kidding, of course. Your ability to play the guitar has nothing to do with uh, your ability to interact with the opposite sex. Um, a little bit, maybe. And everybody would like to play a guitar, but it's uh, it's a very difficult um, difficult art to get into because it is a very complex instrument. It is the the musicality. The music is a very com complex uh, gate to enter in, I suppose. Uh, so yeah, let me uh, be the first guide to teach you to your way to stardom. So uh, this is my guitar. This is my guitar and uh, let me teach you some of the parts of the guitar. This is a hollow acoustic guitar. And this is the neck of the uh, guitar. And each of these grooves over here, like the metal railings, separates the frets of the guitar. So this would be the first fret, and this would be the second, and this would be the third, and so on. And this is the body of the guitar, and this is where you would be strumming, and this is where you would be picking the chords. So, and after you have got your guitar and you put it on your lap like so, you have to uh, remember the position of, of the guitar because uh, when you're practicing this for long stretches of time, you tend to hurt your back or you hurt, tend to hurt your soldier. So, uh, health experts suggest that uh, when playing the guitar, keep your chest uh, like this when you're, sta uh, like, uh, when you're standing in an attention position. So just keep like this. So, your back, back is straight. So without further ado, let's learn some chords. So yeah, the first chord I'll be teaching you is the E minor chord. It's a very easy, basic beginner level chord. So uh, take your um, index, finger, <laughs> index finger and put it on the second fret. Remember I told you about the second fret. First, second, second fret of the second string. First, second string, second string. And take your middle finger and put it on the second fret of the third string. And you play all the strings like from the top to the bottom with your nail. This is the E minor chord, a very sad sounding chord. Uh, mostly used for sad songs, someone like you, the, does that ring a bell? Uh, so, and uh, the second chord I'll be teaching you is the C chord. It's, uh, so your index finger on the first fret on the fifth string, the fifth string over here, and take your uh, the ring, uh, not the ring finger, uh, the middle finger, and put it on the second fret, third string, like this, and then take your uh, ring finger and put it on the th third fret. See, one, two, three, third fret, second string, and this is admittedly a little bit harder, but uh, you gotta practice. And so, just like earlier, put everything down. This is a C chord. It's a little bit happy. And so, uh, let me teach you some strumming patterns. So, the thing, I was doing this. This is what we call a down strum. Down stroke, maybe. Some people would say down stroke. And the other one is the up stroke, where you come up. Uh, most people use their uh, thumbs, the nail of the thumbs. Like this. You go down, and you come up. So, uh, yeah, the most important thing with guitar is like building muscle memories. So you have to keep practice, uh, practicing guitar. There's no uh, simple way around it. Uh, so after you practice for a while, you start to build muscle memories. So, uh, for example, look at me. I can just notice how, my, notice how my thumb automatically comes up all the time. So I don't have to think about it. It's muscle memory. And even on this hand, like... If you're playing uh, with me maybe right now, I hope so, uh, uh, you would notice that if it's your first time playing a guitar, when you uh, press it, and you, ha and you have to press it very hard, your, uh, the skin hurts. So, and according to Healthline experts, uh, it takes about two to four weeks to form calluses because you're pressing so hard. It takes two to four, uh, four weeks to form calluses, and if after you've formed calluses, uh, it doesn't hurt as much when you shred the guitar, I suppose. So yeah, and yeah, and the in, the most important thing I wanted to say was like practice is the key to mastering the guitar. You can like never quit. You have to. Yep. <laughs> so uh, 
Yeah, and I must admit, uh, this has been a very roundabout way of uh, teaching you guitar because chords would be a very later chapter in the book of learning guitar. Uh, in a, and traditionally speaking, of course. Uh, so, uh, and what I noticed uh, with when I was trying to teach guitar to some of my friends was that uh, people didn't learn if they didn't like get the result right away. So, uh, yeah, this has been a simple attempt attempt at teaching you my guitar. Uh, teaching you how to play the guitar i hope you learned something i hope you the i might i hope i am the first one of many guitar tutorials you will learn to become a guitar master and thank you for listening to my speech <laughs>